we raised 20, more than twenty thousand dollars for charity. I'm so happy to be uh, able to give back a little bit while enjoying some awesome food. Here with us by the magic of the internet. This is the world famous St. Elmo Shrimp Cocktail Eating Challenge. Eating bowl after bowl of horseradish laden St. Elmo Shrimp Cocktail in their pursuit of personal glory and personal profit. Today, the greatest eater who has ever lived, Joey Chestnut, seven time and undefeated St. Elmo Shrimp Cocktail Eating Champion of the World, has joined up with the number one ranked female eater of the world, the great Nikki Sudo, in support of charity. We are eating to support Wheeler's Mission, Gleaner's Food Bank, and the Peyton Manning Children's Hospital. Let's bring out our contestants. Mickey Suda. And joining Mickey today in their joint attempt to eat 100 bowls of St. Elmo Shrimp Cocktail in 20 minutes, Joey Jaws Chestnut. Hallowed halls of the world famous St. Elmo Steakhouse. Joey Chestnut getting his serviette ready. I like this already with the horsing around. This is an elegant, refined event, Joey Chestnut. There will be no horseplay. We will get to that in good time, my friend. Five, four, three, two, one. Commence with the dining group. Dining group, people. Today's event, different than a major league eating competition. Joey and Mickey, Mickey and Joey, not going head to head, not eating for themselves, but joining forces. Joey Chestnut has one bowl down already. They are going to attempt to eat 100 bowls of St. Elmo Shrimp Cocktail in 20 minutes, but they're going to do so, as you can see, another delicious St. Elmo Shrimp. We're 2 minutes 45 in. A long way to go. Joey Chestnut says, give me another one of those bowls of St. Elmo Shrimp Cocktail. The secret to his performance in the contest version of this event is that he trains for six weeks leading up to it using a wasabi-based toothpaste to help his mouth prepare for that intense horseradish flavour. Unorthodox and certainly an expensive way to train. But what price? Glory. The proof is in the pudding, and by the pudding I mean seven straight undefeated performances. 2013 to 2019, it's been chestnut, 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 and four times chestnut. Angela Haddam just said we are over $18,000. My concern there is, I stated earlier that our goal is $20,000, and we are not even three and a half minutes into that. So if you're at home and you haven't donated, and your rationale is, well, they're already at, what, what's five times 18? If they're already at... 90%. I'm going to ask Mickey Sudo, please, Mickey, enjoy your tea. I believe it's a, is it a herbal tea or, an, or perhaps an English breakfast? A herbal? Hopefully not chamomile. Hopefully not something that might make you sleepy at the major oh, tea. Joey Chestnut, how, how is this going for you today? This, no one is yelling at you. You respond well to negative reinforcement. When people are yelling, no one is yelling at you. No one is supporting you. You, know, you can feel it in their heart, surely, but no one is chanting your name, no one is booing you. What's it like up here, champ? It's a little weird, but it's tasty. Uh, I catch myself slowing down and enjoying it a little bit. But I'm trying to use a little sense of urgency. We're, we're trying to get that close to the uh, whatever goal. Okay! Coming up to 12 minutes gone, Joey moves to his next bowl. Watching Mickey Sudo eat here today, ladies and gentlemen, in this refine as she reaches for another cup of herbal tea. Oh, this back table. Let's get a shot of the back table if we can. This back table is being filled with. I'm seeing six. I'm seeing a lot of shrimp cocktail back there. Fifteen minutes and fifteen seconds gone, ladies and gentlemen. As Scott and Frank, our elegant service here today, remind us what hospitality looks like. Joe and Chester, outside of the St. Elmo Shrimp Cocktail, what's your spicy go-to fix when it comes to recreational dining? I love my spicy. I love chicken wings, buffalo wings. Uh, not too spicy, but spicy enough you can uh, enjoy the flavor. Spicy enough you can enjoy the flavor. Buffalo wings, best enjoyed in Buffalo, New York. There's one minute to go, ladies and gentlemen. There is one minute to go. We have 31 bowls down. This is this is surprising. 
But it's been elegant, it's been joyous. We've been dining in the name of elegance, dining in the name of charity, dining in the name of supporting restaurants across this country and our three great charities. And that is our 20 minutes. Put down your thoughts. Ladies and gentlemen, at the start of this challenge, zero bowls of St. Elmo shrimp cocktail were consumed. That's because it was the start. And at the conclusion of these 20 minutes of elegant, dedicated, refined dining in the name of service, Mickey Sudo and Joey Chestnut have consumed 33 bowls of St. Elmo's shrimp cocktail. Arise, Sir Chestnut. Woo! Arise, Dame Sudo. Thank you to everybody who donated. Learn more about Wheeler's mission. Learn more about the Peyton Manning Children's Hospital. Learn more about Gleaner's Food Bank. Have a great, safe, and happy holiday season. Give back to the restaurant that you love. Give back to the restaurants in your community. Do buy a gift card if you can. Thank you, everybody, for tuning in. All right, when do we start? <laughs> This was unlike any event that we've done on the circuit, really. Yeah, usually, this is the first time we've ever, I think in the contest, it's the first time I've ever sat down while eating. Hey everybody, Joy Chestnut here. Today I was at St. Elmo's, or we're at St. Elmo's right now. We just got done eating their famous shrimp cocktail for 20 minutes. Me, me and Mickey Sudo. This is in place of the traditional St. Elmo shrimp cocktail eating contest. We've been doing it for seven years because of COVID, we're, we had to do this. But uh, yeah, this year we're, we're raising money for charity. Me and Mickey Sudo were eating for 20 minutes. And our goal was a crazy goal. <laughs> we're trying to hit 100 bowls in 20 minutes. We uh, overestimated our ability. Because they told us we were sitting down while we are eating, or we're eating with a fork, and it's uh, we slowed down a lot more than I imagined. Yeah, I, we, we, I think we only ate 33 bowls, but it, it, it's all right. We raised, uh, I think we raised 20 more than twenty thousand dollars for charity. I'm so happy to be uh, able to give back a little bit, and while enjoying some awesome food, and I still have room for more. Uh, and now it's time to drink. Thank you so much for watching the video. Happy holidays.